to me, the first step is identifying who the audience is. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. who, who we going after? Because if we know who we going after, then we start to build the plan from there. If we're going after the streets, we're going after the internet, we're going to cross over. Like, what were we, what were we, what were we trying to do? Because each one of them is a different map. Yeah. So I think the most important thing is a lot of people skip the first step, which is identifying what you even is. You know, one of the first things most artists say when you meet them, you ask them, so what type of, because this one you're trying to identify the art, audience, you like, so what type of, not comparing yourself to anybody, but what type of artist you, just so we understand who the demographic in the audience is, like, oh, I do everything. <laughs> <laughs> That's tough. Think about it. Yeah. Because most artists from a talent level, you probably can. You probably can do everything. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Nowadays, you got artists who can rap and sing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got artists who can, like, so you can be. But when we try to identify who we going after, who the audience, that ain't a good answer. Because now we just sitting there like, we don't know. We don't know who to, who to go to least first. Yeah. Even if we're going to go. In mo multiple audiences, like we don't even know where to start it. I, I say this thing of like, you may have somebody that work at a, a the Benz dealer and he the um every month he the employee of the month he sell a hundred Benz a month. Then you take him to a Kia store and he can't sell a car. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It's because he don't know the options. He don't that. know the options to the car that he's selling. So you, I gotta know the options. You know what I'm saying? To even to even sell the product. 